Hey, what's up, guys and gals? Rick9G here, and thank you for joining me. Episode 3 here of Empires of the Undergrowth. Very cool, an ant colony simulator, and we're working hard. If you have not seen episode 1 and 2, go ahead and do that. Episode 1 and 2, 1 just introduced me to the game, and I introduced you to the game. And now we're playing the second part of this mission that we are doing, trying to defeat all of these crazy crazy animals, crazy beetles. We are adding food storage here. And we're trying to get as much of this map exposed as humanly possible. I need to add more ants, guys. So look at all this food. There's food everywhere. And so let me just add huge amounts of storage so that all of this, see, now they're starting to actually collect this food. If not, they, they won't, and so it's a waste. So be careful with that. I'm going to definitely place worker ants here and a bunch of soldier ants. Look at the amount of health, not health. Look at the amount of food that I have. An enormous amount. Keep placing storage. Don't forget. Look at that. Now, of course, this is the first level. This is the first mission. So don't think for a second that this is now all simple because it, it is, I'm going to say, it, it does feel a lot simpler than when I just started. But of course, missions are going to get harder. They're going to get tougher. Enemies are going to be bigger. And so, you know, again, the game is in early access in case you, I haven't told you, in case you don't remember or haven't seen the other episodes. Yes, early access. Food storage. Lots of food storage. And the ants are working really hard, guys. They're, they're doing their best. Look at this. All these ants being brought back. Let's bring a couple more. And a lot more food storage. Very nice. There's really no method for me doing this. There's no method to my madness. It's just me going nuts. Kind of thinking clearly, but maybe not so much. We'll see. One entrance in, one entrance out. That's my theory for this game. Best thing you can do. One entrance in, one entrance out. It's your way of dividing and conquering the map. Once you see food, just place storage. It doesn't kill you. And let's say there's not enough food. Well, they're not going to do anything with that storage. They'll just save it for later. So keep that in mind. All right. So let me just... Oh, I didn't want to do that. So if you click on the area again, it goes back. I don't want to expose my queen to unnecessary dangers. So... Let me do this. It'll make it easier for them to get to the areas I want them to get to. Right there. That's it. I don't want them to dig out to my queen. Yes, my queen. Of course, we will expose all of this. And very nice. Okay. Look at the line of ants, guys. So this is going to save them a little bit of time. I don't want to open that, as I said. Let's just cut across. I'll make it a lot easier, and this is letting me know that I need more ants. Definitely need more ants. A couple more soldiers. All right, so I ran out of food right there. So let's keep it moving. They're making their way through here, so now they have an easier way to get to the queen. This will be a lot easier for us, guys. A lot easier. We have a huge part of the map exposed. Let me get to this area. Let me bring all my soldiers down here. This is going to be a big one, guys. This is going to be a massive offensive right here. So the soldiers are making their way down. There they go. You see them? My big army. Army of soldier ants. Yes. <laughs> Alright, so I do want to play storage they can start laying it down come on guys get a move on just want to be careful I have a feeling there's lots of enemies here I don't even want to think oh my goodness this was dumb guys this was bad this is really bad this this might be the end right here I don't think my ants will make it I had no idea there was like 10 of these guys Oh my goodness! Oh, <gasps> did they do it? Oh my gosh, guys! My ants are victorious. How many do I have left? I have twelve. Man, we lost a lot of these guys a lot. I'm talking about a lot. Wow. Well, it's okay. 
It's okay, we'll keep them going. We gotta expand. Wait. I have 45 soldiers? No way. Oh, where did these guys come from? That's insane. Let's keep them coming. Got a lot of food, guys. Got to place in the right spots. I definitely think we need more red ants. More worker ants. Can't have enough of those. We have tons of food going. And I noticed that. So if you place them, see how they're taking the food, guys? See the little white specks? So all this is, uh, whatever those are, little beetles, earwigs, taking all that food, taking all that food, using it up. Look at that, 122. So, let's break up this whole little area that is totally unnecessary to be here. Hopefully there's some food, which is our currency. And I haven't even started Mission 2. I think after this video, I'll definitely do Mission 2. Take a look at that. And guys, remember, this is early access. So Slug Disco, the developer, has a lot of cool things coming up. I know that there will be over-the-surface stuff. I don't know if Mission 2 might be over-the-surface or on-the-surface stuff. That'll be awesome. I'm so excited to see that. And this is it. This is the edge of the map. So let's start some digging down here. And of course, add food storage in this area. I don't know if that even make a difference. It might. And see, as you expand, you have more space to place more stuff. So there we go. Place a few more soldier ants. We'll go. Oh, let's go over here. I see all those exclamation points. I'm just trying to be careful. Now the thing is, the queen is very, not as protected as before. She's okay. Okay, so there we go. We expose that. Let's get her soldiers over here. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Let's get her soldiers here. Come on, guys. We don't want these guys to overrun us. There we go. There are soldiers. See, you got to keep your soldiers in the right spot, because then they'll advance and start attacking your, your queen. You don't want that, guys. You don't want that. Just be very careful. Let's get food storage going. These workers are already working even though the base is under attack. They don't care. They're hard working. Hard working. You can place them on top of the food and that'll cut down on time as well. And look at that. They decimated. They completely decimated the enemy. Look at that. Just ate them up. That's what ants do. They're decomposers. They are strong in number. When they are a lot of ants, that's where they get their power. Not in one, but in many. Let's continue growing our ant pop. Placing lots of soldiers. Lots of workers. Look at, they're making just putty out of all of this. This is nothing to them now. Look at this, we got one enemy. So eventually the level will end when you do have a lot of this stuff eaten up and ready. So let's move our soldiers this way. And let's get as much as we can of all this territory. They're eating straight through it. All right, and let's just eat through it. We should be fine. We have so many ants. How, how is that like a possibility? There we go, look at this, look at this. Well done, you've killed all the devil coach horse larva. Wow. When you are ready for a greater challenge, go back to the main menu, select the lax level. Let us know what you think by clicking the feedback button, leaving us a message on Stomped. We are on Kickstarter and the information is here. I'll let you read that, guys. Of course, pause the video if you want to read. The Slug Disco Team feedback. I have left some feedback. I won't do it here. And there we go. There's our main menu. Thank you so much, guys and gals, for joining me. In this episode, episode 3, we're going to try the second level and see how that works right over here. Start the nest. We'll see what that's about. I've never clicked on it. It'll be a complete surprise to me, but you got to wait for the next episode. Leave a thumbs up if you want to see the next episode, like I said. And don't forget, guys and gals, be hopeful.